Um, I'm going to show you how to deep fry potato because we all need some deep fried carbs in our life right now. So this is a, another Mauritian Gajak and all I'm going to be using is some gram flour that I have here um, and I'm just going to add some garlic and ginger paste to that. I've got some frozen coriander. Then in here the spices I'm going to use is turmeric, paprika and some cumin seeds. Now you guys can add whatever flavour you like to this. I'm using paprika for a bit of colour and flavour but if you have chilli powder please use that. I'm going to make it for the baby so I don't want it to be too hot. Um, if you have only curry powder or something in your cupboards just use this. What you're trying to do is add some flavour to the potatoes as we deep fry them. I also have some frozen coriander, I can't remember if I've said that or not. And all of that is going to get mixed up into a batter. So um, I'm only going to be using a small potato. And all I need to do is chop this super, super thin. And the reason why it's so thin is because basically this batter is going to be almost like a pancake batter. And we're literally going to dip these in and deep fry them. Um, and that's it basically. So I'm going to show you how to do this. You can basically dip this batter in anything. In Mauritius we also use bread, which is jipe frio, um, which we, we deep fry in this batter. So this batter is super versatile and can be used for anything. So it's a great way to get a little snack in your day without using up too many ingredients. Now, if you don't have gram flour, just use self-raising flour. That should be absolutely fine. So, potatoes are done. I'm just going to make this batter up and I'll show you how I do it. Right, so here we've got the gram flour and I'm just going to add in a little bit of warm water. And I want to just kind of get rid of all those lumps and make it a smooth, almost pancake batter. So, just move that around really simply bit more so it needs to be thick enough to actually coat the potatoes so that looks good to me so it's quite quite thick at this stage and then I'm just going to go in and tip in my coriander which is frozen and I've got quite a bit left over I'm going to add in some garlic ginger paste and then into that goes some salt I've got some cumin seeds, which I'm just going to tip in. As you can see, I'm sort of making this up as I go along, which is perfect. We've got our paprika. And then finally, some turmeric for flavour and colour as well. And just whisk that all together. Okay, so all the potatoes are in here, and I'm going to take a slice and place it straight in the hot oil. Guys, another little trick is don't waste any of this, so I'm just going to pour little bits in. And these are going to get fried off. And these are delicious. They're going to be the little crispy bits. Right guys, that's my recipe for deep fried potato in a spicy batter and I'm serving mine with a mango and lime chilli sauce which we make at La Casa Mama, my restaurant. So yeah, I hope you enjoy it and do give it a try.